Hello. Today we're going to look at the Walther PDP. This is um, the replacement for the Walther PPQ. This is a PPQ. This is the PDP. Um, I got the longer slide on this. This is the five inch slide. Um, this is like the four. I think it's four inch. Yeah. So, but I love these guns, the PPQ. So when the PDP came out, I, get, I went out and bought one and um, I, I love them. They take the same mags as the PPQ. They come with uh, two 15 round mags or you can get them with the, um, the longer ones in their 18 round mags. Me, because I already had the 15 rounders, I got the, um, the shorter handle and then I, you can also get, this is a 17 round. It's a, like a plus two, which that worked great too. So I already had a bunch of mags. So I went with the shorter one. Plus for me, that, that fits in my hand really nice. I can see. So, um, the feel of this is really nice. The texturing, anybody that's had a uh, PPQ, this texturing is incredible. The ergonomics is the best I've ever felt in any gun. And they went with the same kind of ergonomics, but they changed the texturing a little bit. So I don't know how well you can see the texturing on that, but they're kind of like little um, hexagons, but it's kind of nice. So uh, let's get a weight on it. So it's 26 ounces and make sure it's empty. And let's get a trigger pull on it. These little things. So three pounds, eight ounces. So it's a really nice trigger. I have to say that Walther has probably one of the best triggers I've ever uh, shot. It, it, they're just incredibly good, the triggers on the Walthers. That's why I bought the the uh, PPQ originally, is I looked at the um, SIG uh, P320, and I didn't like the trigger, and then I ended up buying this one because it was recommended. And this has got a great trigger like that as well. They've um, it's got the same like ambidextrous slide release and one thing i love about uh these slide releases i hate the little tiny ones because i i don't have a big thumb so i can't reach them when they're over there i have to reposition the hand where well, these are nice and long so anybody with any size hand can hit that slide release so to me i i like that style better than the short ones that you see on like the glocks and stuff um, this has got the M2 style mag release, which is reversible as well. Um, the side, the slide serrations, they're really nice. You can pretty much grab anywhere on the front or back. The looks, I liked the PPQ looks a little bit better. This is more aggressive. Uh, this looks more elegant. So it, it's kind of up to personal taste for that because some may like this better but other than that i mean it looks nice it does look nice i just i like the other look better it's the trigger's got the glock style trigger so um it's, it's unloaded so got a nice let off and the reset is right there so the reset is real, real short. Like I said, the, the triggers on these things are great. So that's the reset right there. So um, it's got one of the best trigger pulls and best resets that I've ever seen on a gun. Um, this one's got the adjustable three dot sights, which like I said, I'm not thrilled on three dots, but it's got the optics mount. So of course it doesn't come with any other uh it doesn't come with plates some guns come with the plates this does not 
Comes with uh, interchangeable back straps, different size. This is the smallest one. So I, I do believe it's got three of them. When you just pop the pin out and you pull the um, back strap off and you can change it. It doesn't have side panels. It just has the back strap. But, um, well, let's take it out to the range and see how it shoots. So today we're going to look at the Walther PVP. This is the long slide five inch barrel. So, no problems at all. And I'm firing the uh, cheap steel stuff. So we'll put another 17 rounds. Flawless. So, Walther PDP with the five inch side and the, the short grip. So, out at the range, you can see it worked flawless. And I was using this cheap, crappy stuff that I still got some left. So, but like I said, if a gun fires that, it'll fire anything. And I've fired this with brass and stuff. I've never had a single malfunction in this at all. None of my Walters, they, they always shoot great. So I have to say, I, I really do like the Walters. I think they're top notch um, manufacturer. So um, let's take it apart. So uh, you pop the mag out and then it it's kind of like the Glock, but it's got this little thing here so you just pop it down ah. gonna pop it down hold it down and then pull the trigger and then it slides off and then you've got the spring in the barrel so it's pretty much the same as most guns but, and then put it back together you just slide it on. And that's it. And this will automatically pop up. So, uh, accuracy on this was awesome. The five inch barrel made a difference. I had no problem hitting anything that I was aiming at. So, it definitely, it's definitely a nice gun. If you're looking for something for competition shooting, or carry. They do make it in a four inch barrel like the uh, PPQ was. Um, they may also make it with the 18 inch mag instead of the 15 inch. So if you're looking for a higher capacity or if you're hand, you know, if you want a little bit more for a handle, you can do that. Um, and they're interchangeable, the 18 inch to the 15 inch. Or if you get uh, 15 round, not 15 inch. Um, so, like, I got the 15 round with the plus two, which that makes a big difference. You can get those instead of just getting the bigger handle. That's why I got the smaller one is because I just get mags that are just bigger. So, uh, definitely, if you're looking for a nice, you know, gun for target or competition shooting or just for carry... I highly recommend the Walther PDP. And uh, in this is in nine millimeter. Uh, I don't think they make the forties yet. But thank you for watching the video and hope you have a good day.